Yo, this is a little blog I wanted to make, just to show you the, the time-consuming process of, um, with the V1 doing uh, 24p capturing. So, this is what you gotta do. You gotta set the preset for Apple Pro Res 422. You gotta come over here, you gotta see what's next on your screen here, you gotta see what's going on next. Our next shot is, okay, you see that? I'm I'm calling this the Asian reveal shot. So I'm going to rewind to the bars. Rewinding to the bars. I'm going to stop there. And then uh, what I'm going to do is we'll come up to... I'm going to log and capture. Now, all it does is bring up this little window that says... I don't think you can read it. But it says, uh, maybe I can zoom in. Yeah, it says, uh, you know, file name. Are oh, you going to capture it? What's the file name? Well, I'm calling this Asian Reveal Takes. And I'm not going to put 01 or 02 or anything like that. Or actually, I could put 1, so let's put. No, I'm not going to put anything. So I got, I don't know, I don't think, I think it's kind of blurry, but it says Asian Reveal Takes, right? And we hit the capture button, and it's going to automatically cue up the camera. It's going to start rolling. I can hear it in my headphones, and then here it goes. You can see it on the screen. It's going to start. It's going to start going. Now what's going on is the the camera shoots in 60i, shoots 30 frames a second, 60i. But the camera also has this built-in preset for 24 frames a second. So what it does is when you end the shot in the camera, it cycles, it makes sure that the next time you hit record, it gets onto an A frame so that it can pick up and make sure the right frames are dropped off. But what happens is, at least with my slow-ass computer, I don't know if you can see down here, it says, well, I can read it right here on the bottom. I'll read it for you. It says, capture is 36% behind the camera view the camera for monitoring. So, you can see, you can literally see the two differences in frames. There's an Asian guy, there's no Asian guy. There's an Asian guy, far isn't it? So the camera's rolling up here. It's already on the next shot. But but because we're re-rendering each new frame, because it, now it's 24 frames a second and we're dropping frames out, the computer has to process. And what's happening is uh, capturing doesn't happen in real time anymore. Capturing happens in... Um, longer time. And uh, I just wanted to make this little blog just to show you how intensive the capturing process is. All of this is just to digitize the footage. My next investment is definitely going to be a camera, digital cam a, a video camera that shoots on a media like a P2 card or an S by S card. That's going to be my next thing. That way I can just put in the card, dump the footage, and it's captured. Because it's time consuming. And, uh, but I look forward to uh, to you seeing it all when it's done. Alright, signing out. A little bit of geek stuff for you. I'm Steve DiCasso. Later.